Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So today I am going to be teaching you some tips that I would use if you're looking to become a better hitter. So here we go. So I would say that the number one thing that you should always work on is having a comfortable stance. Like one that you're happy with and you hit good with. Um, it's preference, but you need a good stance to be a good hitter that you're comfortable with. So, uh, uh, coming in at number two, I would say practice. Like, right now, I'm outside practicing, right, but you need to practice a lot. Um, so, hitting in the cage, hitting off a tee like I'm doing right now, soft toss, whatever, live pitching, you just need to practice. And use that same stance, don't change it, and, you know, just keep things the same and you'll end up eventually getting better. So, number three or four, I believe, is definitely don't try and swing for the fences. Because then, you're going to hit a routine pop-up, and you're going to get out every single time, or you're going to strike out. Because that's just how it works when you try to swing for the fences. Like, right here, I will show you an example of what I mean. So... You want to hit the ball straight on a line drive. That's where you're going to get your best results. I'll show you what I mean. Just watch the difference in the exit velocity between a line drive and a pop-up. This is the line drive. So got on top of it a little bit, but still, it's pretty quick. Now if you swing for the fences and you do an uppercut, this is what happens. Well, I hit a line drive on the second one, but you would pop up or strike out. You just have to believe me. The next one, which I think is also I think is also important, is use a bat that is big enough and it's light enough for you, or whatever you want, heavy enough. You have to make sure you're comfortable with your bat. Or you can't hit. Good. So I would say our next tip is weightlifting and I know you don't have to be weightlift or you don't have to weightlift to be good it just helps with power and everything and hitting the ball to the gap and getting extra base hits. Another great way to get better at hitting is when you don't do good like you pop up or you ground out run like punish yourself like do a lap or something do a pull or a few pulls, like, just make sure that when you don't do what you want, then you run, or whatever you hate, like six inches or something, it'll make you want to hit the ball better, and make you better, as it, you know, if you keep doing that. So my next tip, which will also be my last tip, is just to play baseball. So I know that that sounds stupid, but, you know, show up to every practice, go to every game, try and get better during the season. I guarantee you it'll make you a better hitter. If you try, give it 100% and, you know, just work all the time on it. So, yeah. Alright guys, that is going to be it for the video. Hope you enjoyed. This was a bit of a short video, but I just wanted to give you some quick tips on a way to get better at hitting for me. It really helps, so hope you enjoyed. Um, should be a few more videos coming this month. Uh, I can't guarantee it, but it should. So, yeah. And I will see you in the next video. So peace out.